All right, guys, I've uh, got it figured out, and I'm going to do a screen capture video here of exactly how I do it. Hopefully I've got everything set up so I don't have any problems because my screen capture here was recording the original audio from this, this video track as well as my voice over here. So hopefully I've got it figured out here. Um, I've made uh, two little clips of that original video and I'm going to edit one of them so when, when I replay this on the screen you'll be able to see the difference here. But here's the procedure. Tools, power tools, crop and zoom crop zoom and now I'm going to zoom in or crop I should say and reposition it where I want the crop to begin or be at at the beginning of my video then I'm gonna let the video play until it gets to the point that I want to start panning and it kind of jumped there on me. For some reason, my video card lags a little bit. So I'm going to back this up. And let's say I want the pan of that exact same zoom to start at this point. Duplicate the keyframe, previous keyframe. Now I'm going to let it go until I get to the point in the video where I want the pan to stop and let's say I want it to stop right here. I'm going to duplicate that previous keyframe. This is the piece, one of the two pieces that I was missing. I need to go to the next keyframe, I'm sorry, wrong key, the next keyframe and duplicate that keyframe again. Now all four keyframes are exactly the same. You will see that the the rectangle or the crop section does not move. What I want to do is want to go to the one where I want the pan to end up at and simply move it where I want it to be at this portion of the video. Then this is the other piece that I was missing. Go to the last keyframe and duplicate the third keyframe. So now I've got the crop starting right here and it stays there until it gets to this position which is right there. Then it will move across here to this position and will stay there until the end of the video. Simply press OK and there we have it. I'm going to back this up so you can see that the original video has the entire scene showing and then when we get into the crop or the pan and zoom or crop and zoom I'm and here in a second you'll see it pan across just exactly like I wanted it to and gets to that point and it stops Oop, I don't need that so anyway that's how to do it um, I'm gonna post this up on YouTube along with the step-by-step -step instructions I want to thank you guys I know it's probably a little bit uh, aggravating that uh, couldn't quite get through my thick skull, but uh, Barry's video really helped and, and gave me probably 95% of what I needed to know. And with that, we were able to figure it out. I'm going to leave this video up. I hardly ever delete anything off of YouTube, so if you guys want to refer to it, uh, put it in your favorites or whatever, go right ahead. It'll be there for years, so well, at least until PD-14 becomes obsolete. So I want to thank you guys, and we got it done. That's the beauty of these forums. Thanks, guys.